Yeah, so uh, where do we put our middle finger? Do you know? So it's supposed to touch a little bit of the silver part. So you, what you're doing is too much mm -hmm. to the front. And so in the tip of the finger should be touching half silver, half hair. Can you repeat with me? Half, half silver, silver half, half hair. So can you feel the silver part? Yes, too. Okay, good. Now it's beautiful. Okay, if you go too much here, so this is actually when the baroque player plays because the bow is really light. Sometimes they want to play like this, to play like Bach or like baroque pieces, like, you know, mm, like Handel or something. I'm trying to imagine Other. playing this. <laughs> but when we do regular play, yeah, definitely not this. Because we want that. Yeah, because your thumb will go like this. Well, so, it goes like that. Well, it seems like you want the bow to be a little heavier. Yeah, because we want to have more articulation. But if we want the bow to have an air sound, then we want to have our hands here. But we don't usually use that technique. So just remember middle finger and half silver, half hair to give your bow a little more articulation. to make 
and then the dot notes make it short. Can you, can you do it? Can you try it? So first note short. Up. So do the contrast. Yeah, you did a good bowing 
So, if, but if you do. Bend it down there. 
Okay. <laughs> yeah, and then the Boeings, make sure all the um, eighth notes are, so four notes in the bow. Right? Yeah. 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 That's one, measure 13. Yeah, yeah measure 13.
to it every time. Thank you. 